Hold on, let's switch this light real quick. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Jerry O. Back again with another video. Back again with another reaction, man. And as promised, I told y'all I was going to react to this whole Nasty C mixtape. You know what I'm saying? So, we definitely going to get through this all. I don't know when we're going to finish all of the, you know what I'm saying, songs. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to aim for tomorrow. But you know what I'm saying? Damn near probably tonight. I'm just going to eat some after this reaction right here. And come back up in here and go hard. But we got Nasty C A. Black and MT. Let's get into it. MT made the list once again. Yeah. I see straight through these capping niggas, bro. You can tell. You know a capping nigga when you see one. I'm gonna give y'all three, you know what I'm saying? Valid, valid things to look for. Stuttering. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Or just, you know what I'm saying? Even when the nigga don't look into your eyes, you know what I'm saying? Or, you know what I'm saying? It's just it's just a lot, you know what I'm saying? You can tell when a nigga yeah. just capped out. That boy flows me hard as hell. My slam don't mess with you, no question, I'm a cold side of Hey, bro, listen. I'm glad we got both of these niggas on the song. Blackie and SEC. Now, as y'all know, you know what I'm saying? Y'all watch Mansa Man channel. You know what I'm saying? Who don't know Mansa if you bringing up South Africa? You feel me? Mansa, you know what I'm saying? I guess I was at work. You know what I'm saying? Shout out my boy, Ali. You feel me? He keep me updated on a lot. You know what I'm saying? So, so he sent me this video link to this video where Mansa, you know what I'm saying, was on Everything SA. And he was speaking on the situation where they asked him the question. They was like, um, who, which artist from SA, you know what I'm saying, is the ones that could go to the States and pop, you know what I'm saying? And he gave his reasoning and he explained it and all of that good stuff. And then I guess somebody went and made a video about it, you know what I'm saying? And basically said that he was throwing shade, which I thought differently, you know what I'm saying? It was just an opinion. And it was facts of what he was speaking on, G. Like, it was facts. You know what I'm saying? In the comment section down below. Y'all let me know y'all thoughts down below. Also, let me know if you've seen the video. You know what I'm saying? I'm going um, to react to it. And we're going to really, you know what I'm saying, get everybody thoughts and shit on it, too. You feel me? Because I was at work at the time as I'm watching this video. So, I really didn't get to tap in for real, for real, how I wanted to. Who made this motherfucking beat? can't beat the, the the car warmer seats bro i swear to god you can't like them mugs come in handy you know what i'm saying it really do be sending it, re, it really do be seeming pointless sometimes but when that winter time hit g and them seats heated my boy i'm telling you they get you right you feel me because i remember last winter g i had no heat inside my whip you feel me i'm driving around with no heat you feel me so the whole time i'm you know what i'm saying Window down half of the time because my freaking window would get foggy and stuff. One time, bro, I was at work, bro. I used to work at McDonald's. It was about like 12 o'clock. I used to work second shift, but I would have to close, you know what I'm saying? So it would, we would close at 11, but we had to stay an extra hour or two, you know what I'm saying, to clean up and, you know what I'm saying, get it ready for the next day. So I'd do that. So it was one time, you know what I'm saying, this is when my heat first, you know what I'm saying, broke in my whip. So I'm knowing that he's about to break, but I ain't know how cold it was gonna get outside. So I get outside, you know what I'm saying? Mind you, I didn't warm the car up at all. So I get out there and my whole front, you know what I'm saying, window is just froze, G. I swear to God, I can't look, I can't look, I can't see out of it. So I, I go in the whip and I'm looking for my scraper. Can't find one. Now mind you, I got this like spray that my mama bought me, 
And it's where, like, if you spray it on the ice, it get rid of it. So I'm using that, but, like, it's not getting rid of all the ice because it's just so, you know what I'm saying, hard and froze on my, my freaking window. You know what I'm saying? So I had to get, uh, like, the bottom of the, the thing. Let me show you. Look, it looked like a can like this, you know what I'm saying? The bottom was like this. So I had to use the bottom, and I had to scrape the window just like that, I swear to God. And that's how I had to, you know what I'm saying, dry home. It's crazy. I'm gonna cut like an editor. Ooh. What happened to Virgil? I got a question though. I wasn't around, you know what I'm saying? Is that. The reason why Nasty C give us that like that military image is that because he called his clan, you know what I'm saying, us, you know what I'm saying, them, y'all, you know what I'm saying, her, him, you know what I'm saying? Is that why he he called um is that why he got the like the military image cuz he called his like his group the army, Iverson army? Let me know in the comment section down below. You know what I'm saying? Gotta get to this paper first, oh God. Okay. Okay. It's on hard, I ain't gonna hold you. Y'all, yeah. yeah, I ain't gonna lie. This right here, y'all, this one of those. I'm gonna tell you why. This one right here, yeah. Look, G, I ain't, I ain't even expect MT to work on this song right here. You know what I'm saying? First of all, beat choice perfect, and and the way they placed everybody was, was perfect as well. You know what I'm saying? You know you had to have Blackie on the hook. He always have a good hook. And the energy, I can just imagine the energy this man gave off in the studio, bro. It's like, there's no way you can't give him a good verse, you know what I'm saying, after hearing a hook like that. You know what I'm saying? You got to love artists like that. I be comparing it to, like, basketball and shit, like Kobe, for example. You know what I'm saying? There's no way in hell you, you're playing with Kobe and you, you, you haven't gained a better worth ethic or, you know what I'm saying, a passion for the game. Or more, you more disciplined. You got to be more disciplined. You got to do something because he that type of person. He give you that type of energy. You know what I'm saying? Being around Kobe probably. I don't even know the nigga. He gave me that energy. That's what you feel me? That's what, I'm That's what I'm trying to say. Like, I'm knowing being around Kobe, he give you that energy where like, Oh, I gotta do this, you know what I'm saying? Or yeah, so that's what Blackie did. When you, when you hear a Blackie hook, G, it's like I gotta throw a good verse on there, you know what I'm saying? That's just the energy, you feel me? But y'all, let me know y'all thoughts down below on what y'all thought about this track, you know what I'm saying? Also, you know what I'm saying? We only two songs in, three, three songs in on this tape. Let me know in the comment section down below what's y'all favorite song so far, you know what I'm saying? I gotta know that, but be sure to like the video, comment down below, subscribe to your boy, okay, your boy, your friend, Jenner's also. If you got any other songs or videos you'd like to see me react, let me know in the comment section down below. But it's me, boy, Jerry, I'm gone.